Hey, did you poop today? Because I'm guessing, with the exception of the chronically constipated and those tragically born without a butthole, you did. Isn't it glorious? <laughs> hey, just a little reminder, that daily act of release is the body's proof that it can filter and remove waste all by itself. Every time you drop a deuce, take a leak, sweat like a pig, or become sober. <clears throat> sober. Your amazing organs are doing their job of scrubbing your gross, gross body from the inside out. But people are still buying into this detox industry's claim that we're full of toxins and need to be cleansed. Or at least de-bloated. And we blame them for all our shitty first world problems. My skin just doesn't glow. I'm still tired after my nap. My burps smell like rotted deer carcass. So we buy pills and we shove an edible vile crap into juicers and we have celebrities give us their recipes for rancid lemonade that will flush our contaminants and shrink our back boobs and, and colons. Don't even get me started on colonics. Shoving a garden hose up your butt does not make you Aqua Gandhi. <clears throat> totally pitching that character to Marvel Comics. Dibs. You know, if people are willing to throw money at this crap, I could probably come up with my own cleanse and reap the financial benefits. I just have to think about it. I'm a thinking cap. It's my own blend. I got it. For all you hardcore ballistic CrossFit types out there, I introduce the Hardcore Cleanse. Real cleaning products! Guaranteed to circumvent the placebo effect, fumigate your innards, and generally sterilize the shit out of ya. Cheers! Hold on. It's the subscriber phone. Gives me hints, tips, life lessons. What you got? Dangerous. Well, they know. What? Well, okay, dude, I'll make a warning. Warning. Piper is a trained idiot. Do not begin the hardcore cleanse without consulting your doctor first. Side effects may include nausea, jimmy legs, blurred vision, tooth disorder, emotional ejaculation, hair pain, nipple tremors, philosophical brooding, and death. A whole lot of death. Only undertake the hardcore cleanse under the strict supervision of questionably trained crossfitters who can falcon punch your heart back into rhythm and carry you to the nearest emergency room. Here we go. For that deep down, minty fresh clean. Ugh, minty. <laughs> Glass cleaner. Nothing better. I mean, I mean, when you need just something in the face, or a little bit more in the mouth, I get, oh, I get the toxins off your tongue or out of your throat or off your teeth or, you know, gives you that streak-free shine that everybody's looking for. Medicated foot powder? It's got all the, it's got the, the talc and stuff in it, so just liberally just get that all, all up in your shit. It's, it's bringing out, it's, it's bringing out the toxins. I can, I can feel it. I can feel it happening. Dishwashing soap, dishwashing soap. Just, I mean, it's really good for the scalp. It really pulls out all the stuff that, you know, you just get it in there. And uh, it just, I mean, I use it instead of shampoo. Still tingling, still, still tingling. Uh, the lemons are good. Mr. Plumber. Mr. P I mean, it's flush out the colon. It's sometimes you gotta, it's in my bones! Just remember, body problems or not, it could always be worse. <laughs> Click that subscribe button for wickedness every Wednesday and check out my other videos for more questionable ideas.